it's Kelly and thank you for joining me on Me More TV. Today's video is a paleo vegetarian salad. So here I've just used um, a half a packet of spinach which I had in the fridge and then this is basically using all my leftovers. I'm going to slice the eggs. Gosh, I hope you've got one of these because it makes life so much easier like that. Slice the eggs. I'm putting them in first because I want them to sort of get mashed around a little bit with the rest of the ingredients. Of course, if you want this to be vegan, don't put the eggs in. Tomatoes, I've used just a small punnet of organic um, tomatoes. I personally like to uh, just cut my tomatoes in quarters. Uh, so even half, I think, can be a bit overpowering if you have a mouthful of salad. Throw it in. Red pepper. Again, leftover, I prepared a bunch of peppers for the children for their after school snack. And these are leftover, so I'm just going to chop them up. That was roughly about one and a half peppers. Throw it in. And then, cogetti spaghetti. <laughs> just renamed it. Raw, 100% organic, delivered to the house, don't have time to do this myself. So, but I love this with spinach and everything else that I've got in there. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at that. Let's get it all, get that spaghetti through. So this, you can see the only thing that really is not left over is the cogetti spaghetti. And that's the main sort of ingredient. Everything else is left over, so I can just throw it but it will make, as you can see, a really substantial um, salad. Now, we're not finished there. I just want to get that all through. The eggs all breaking up. Beautiful. Half an onion, left over. Half an avocado, left over. I noticed I had some parsley in the fridge. This does keep for quite a while. And I thought, oh, that would taste lovely going with that sort of green theme. So with the parsley, I'm just gonna chop it as fine as I can. Wow! Look at that. Do you know, my brother is actually a chef. He taught me that. <laughs> That's all he taught me. <laughs> anyway, that just makes it really, really fine, which is perfect for parsley. I feel so professional when I do that. Do I look it? <laughs> Don't answer that. Put all the parsley in. Boom. Now I'm just going to add a little bit of avocado oil. This is a new oil that I'm, I've started to use. It's great for um, salads, but it's also you can cook on high heat too. Little one, two, three, onto the avocado. So I want to mix that through before I put in the pomegranate. I just don't want that too covered in oil because I think we want that real sort of sweet crunch. So just mixing all the onion, avocado. This is again, everything just left over from the fridge, apart from the courgette spaghetti. That was a, a brand new packet, which has gone straight in. Oh, look at that. This can be a side or it can be a main. Today, it's my lunch. Last thing I'm going to throw in is pomegranate. Again, <laughs> because it was left over in the fridge, and I think this could taste quite good. I put pomegranate in a few different salads, but I'll soon find out. Look at that. I mean, that just looks so good. It's just a bunch of stuff left over in the fridge with the uh, courgette spaghetti. Taste test. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Joking. What do you think I'm gonna say? That tastes great. What I love is the red onion, if you like red onion. The red onion, the pomegranate. It's just a lot of flavors going on there and the parsley is a nice little added touch too. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, I do make other videos on paleo lifestyle and beauty. So please subscribe and you can find me on social media at memore.tv.